I think everyone's pretty excited, obviously, this week. Um, uh, we've got a few nervous players around uh, just with squad selections and things like that, but I think everyone's pretty excited. The first Olympics for a couple, or most of us, and yeah, just excited to get over there. The qualifiers gave us a lot of confidence. Um, you know, we played some, you know, powerhouses in, in the game um, when we were over in Japan, and I think that gave us a lot of confidence. And you know, we've just tried to build on that over the last few weeks, um, being all together. But it'll be good to get over to Brazil and have, you know, the whole squad there, the, the overseas players coming in, and you know, building on f from what we did in the qualifiers. Yeah, um, I never really thought that I was that small uh, when I was growing up. I, I obviously was, but it really didn't play on my mind at all. Um, you know, I, I grew up playing with the boys, so physically um, I was able to go up against stronger and taller opponents, and I guess that's just kind of, you know, paved the way. Um, as I've grown up, it's always been the, that way, and I, I haven't known anything, anything different. I did, and the coach brings it up all the time that it'll, it'll be the only one I ever score. So maybe putting another header in the back of the net will, will keep him a bit more quiet. I watch a couple of players, um, you know, Kim Little, who played for Melbourne City. I think that she's a fantastic player, like her movement off the ball. And, you know, just the things that she creates on the ball is, is pretty um, exceptional. And also Miyama from Japan. I think she's an incredible player and a player that's been around forever. And and known as one of the best footballers in the world. So I guess they're two players that I kind of build my game on. Um, and then you have the likes of Messi and, and a few others in the, the men's game. Maybe my long range shots. Um, you know, being so small, you wouldn't think I'd get much power on the ball, but somehow I do. Um, I guess growing up uh, playing against the boys, it kind of you know, gave me that confidence. Um, I'd have a lot of coaches come up, up to me saying that I was a really good player and that I mixed with the, bells, the boys pretty well. So I think that kind of gave me confidence to you know, go on and, and live a dream in football. And watching the, the World Cup in Germany when the girls are playing over there, um, just seeing how well they did and you know, how much they've grown um, when they were so young, it was kind of something that switched in my brain that made me want to be in the World Cup and the Olympics one day as well.